Hey, a pleasant good day, everyone. This is Sports Fanatic News. I'm Joe Borg, and this is going to be a quick beginning of May recap for the first three games of May. They got three left after this for our Philadelphia Flyers as they round out this disappointing yet still at the end of the season because of some young guys getting a chance. Fun to watch because of Wade Allison and some others. Cam York's going to be making his debut tomorrow. But let's get right into it. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy the content. Trying to get the numbers up. I really appreciate your support. Thank you very much for subscribing and watching the video. But in the first game of the month, the Flyers unfortunately could not solve Mackenzie Blackwood yet again as he made 31 saves on 32 shots for a 969 save percentage in that game. And Brian Elliott was not entirely sharp in this game, but the Flyers still did not protect very well as Brack, Kukunen on a one-timer, he's sheer, and yet and Sharon Govich uh, were all able to score in that game. And then for the Flyers, a guy that's obviously been doing good even when not scoring points on the ice all season. That's been noticeable more often than not in Joel Fairby was the lone guy that was able to pick, keep up and uh pick up a goal in that game where Ghost got an assist along with Knack who's been struggling so it's good to see him get an assist in that game. Ghost is unfortunately suspended for two of the final three games but um, he thought that he played a pretty good season. I think he did too. He commented about that earlier today. So Jamie, Bascal, and others put it online. Follow Jamie if you don't on Twitter. Definitely recommend that. But he definitely had a good season. Maybe he will still get into the final game of the season. I also think Felix Sandstrom with how well he's owning. Watch my uh, Phantoms. I'll put it at the end of screen here. The Phantoms um, beginning of May recap. But he should get a chance in the final game of the season. They already committed to Elliott and Lyon for the next two. But I believe in that order, but I believe that he should get a chance for potentially the last game of the season with how hot it's been. You can't, at this point of the season, we're out of the playoffs. You're not losing anything by giving him a chance to start, especially with how hot he's been. But let's move into the lone good game of the week, the game that the Flyers and Alex Lyon aforementioned really stepped up, played well, and he had a save of the year candidate as one of his 35 big saves, J diving back when he lost his stick with the blocker there, making that great save. His Lyon just looked zoned in in that game, didn't have a lot of action early. Then they kind of just kept coming, coming, and coming after the Flyers scored shots-wise for the Penguins, but the Flyers dominated on the score sheet in this game, and Alex Lyon kept them ahead in a couple plays when this game probably could have really been 7-4 to four or 7-5 to five even on a couple breakdowns there that brought the shot total close, but Alex Lyon played a great game himself. The captain, who's been good all season, played a fantastic game, and then Wade Allison was able to pot his second goal in this game. Giroux was able to pot two goals in this game, one being an empty net, of course, and then Hag got the late wrist shot on the give-and-go there um, with Farabee, so that was nice to see, and Voracek got the assist on that one. And then Ghost also did very good in this game as well. Um, in this in this outing as well, obviously prior to his suspension. So it's nice to see him round out his season very good if he is going to end up sitting the last three since he's out for two of the three anyway. So we'll see if he gets back in for the final game. Well, on his goal, Drew had the assist. So Drew played a great game in that one to be able to take it out in two goals and an assist. And then Goss' pair just continued to do well. TK was able to get an assist on that. And then Ghost got an assist also on Allison's goal. So it was great to see a young guy in Allison do well and two veterans in Gosses Bear and Giroux do really well as well is Alex Lyon, who got his sixth win in his career against those Pittsburgh Penguins. And then, <clears throat> just as the Flyers killed the Penguins the night before, they pounded them the night after 7-3. to three. The Flyers didn't have an answer in this game. Uh, Elliott has a couple in this game. He probably won't bat, but they really didn't protect the net that well. Uh, you had Pedersen, Gensel, Crosby score before Braun was able to get that one on the side of the net that Allison was able to get his first assist, so congratulations to him for that. And Couturier, another guy who's actually been consistent throughout the season, got his 16th goal assisted by Giroux, who stayed hot this year as well. And then TK, who you want to see potting goals. This game was not a good game by any stretch, low 7-3, but positives, you want to see potting goals. And for people that want to get the better draft pick it's actually better to lose for those people so we have positives with TK doing good Giroux doing good again and Couturier doing good again in this game as well as Sanheim being able to pot assist when it's been more of a struggle bunny season than consistent season for Sanheim this year but I have no fear that he will bounce back next year and then of course Mark Friedman was able to score in this game the one that got ghost suspended uh, when he checked him in the back for those two games there 
But this has been a reaction to the Flyers games for the beginning of May. They, of course, have three games left, two against those Washington Capitals, and then the final home game next Monday against the New Jersey Devils. Hope you all enjoyed this beginning of May recap for the Philadelphia Flyers. For Sports Fan News, I'm Joe Bork. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and subscribe to the Steel Flyers website as well as the Steel Flyers YouTube page. Peace out, everybody. Stay safe, and enjoy all the great Flyers hockey. The last three games around at the season where I will be doing a preview for tomorrow that I will release for the next three games. Stay safe out there, enjoy the hockey, and for all my baseball fans as well, enjoy the ball games as well. Peace out, everybody.